Hi guys developers So you are welcome to this video This is the sixth video in the series of Rust Control I'm going to be showing how to send command to multiple joints Basically we want to publish to multiple joints In the previous video, if you have not watched it I showed us how to send to individual joints Okay, so I'm going to start from that code and just copy and paste it and I rename it to control multiple so I start from there so basically we cannot in this we cannot make use of this line 7 again because it only publishes for joint theory now we want to have for all the joints so we need to find a way to do that so what I want to do is I want to create a function that actually generates the name for me so so the function actually generates the name for me so what i just need to do is i just bring this guy that i have here and i say name equals and i can come here and do like this plus str so instead of having two i'm going to have the joint number since we already have a naming pattern we've been using so i can now return name okay so after doing this i can now come here to actually generate the names or the individual names so i can say joint equals empty list publish equals to empty list Okay, total joint is equal to 6. So I can create a for loop to generate the names. So I can put total joint. So it actually runs through each joint. So I say joint dot append. Joint dot append. So I call my function joint name. And I put I inside. So actually I plus one because we don't have joint zero. We actually have joint one. So I plus one. So then I put publish dot append. Okay, so what is it appending? Is app appending this guy? Okay, but we can now okay so he's appending this guy so raspy.publish so joint but i in this case so then we can now have okay so we've successfully generated the names and the publishers so we cannot come here now so instead of having pub joint theory we want to send to all the joints so we say again another for loop so let's use j in this case for j in range of total joint again and pub j okay so everything should work fine now everything should work fine now okay so let me navigate okay so i want i navigate to this particular folder and i want to test if my but before that i need to start my i need to roast launch but let me cut make first i need to start my gazebo so that my topics are available so roast launch robots con control dot launch so after doing that i can now Come back to my scripts here and say python control multiple 
okay so it has started publishing so i need to now check my gazebo that i've launched and see if it actually so we can see now that it's actually publishing to all the joints it's actually publishing to all the joints and it's moving in a very funny way so we can actually stop it and change how we publish so what i just need to do is to come to my script i can say that okay i want to change how it publishes so i can just come here maybe i don't want to use a sign function i want to use cos cosine so after doing that and i want to increase the length it goes the angles it goes so times 1.57 which is like the amplitude so i run the file again it started publishing and after doing that i can open my gazebo and start it so we can see so actually our robot is just dancing in a, in a very funny way although it doesn't really make any sense but if you have a particular trajectory you want your robot to follow it is also the same principle you are going to use let's assume you have a trajectory you want the joints to follow so you just come here and you write a function you write an expression you want it to follow and with that you will be able to send your command to multiple joints so in the next tutorial i'm going to be showing us how to actually run this python script from as a node as a node so that's what we'll be going to, i'm going to be showing so watch out for it